Welcome everyone, I'm Ricky from Tech Talk, and as you might have noticed, I have recently changed the background for my videos. This is thanks to the Philips Hue lighting system, and you can just get so many colors and different styles, which is really exciting, and they can do so much. And today, I want to add two new lights to my system and my setup here. So these are called Philips Hue Go Portable Lights, which is their new version, and it offers the ability to charge them up and away you go. It doesn't have to be plugged in via the mains all the time. You can actually charge it up and away you go, which is really exciting. So what we're gonna do today is unbox them and set them up. They're using Bluetooth for connectability and you control through the app, which is available on the iOS App Store or the Google Play Store. And I'm gonna show you how to set them up and what mine looks like at the moment with the different lights that I have currently. So on the front here, we've got name branding. You've got a bit of information. You can see someone holding it here. It could be put in two different positions. You've got the stand-up position, or you can actually lay it down and the light can shine up, which is quite nice. And then down here, it says that it can go from a warm white to a cool daylight. And you've got 16 million different color choices, which is fantastic to see. And then obviously Bluetooth and it's app controlled. So down the left hand side we've just got a bit more information here. I'm going to talk a bit more in greater detail. But you can set the scene in your room with Bluetooth app control as I've mentioned. Directly control all lights in your room. So again you can just select different lights for different rooms but control them with one switch which is really amazing. With these lights you can easily create a really nice ambience or a setting or a scene. Say you're having a romantic meal, say you want to enjoy your gaming, you can have it sync up with consoles, you can have it sync up with music. It can be really enjoyable what you can do with these lights and so much different things to offer. As I mentioned, you will need the app as you can see here, which is the Philips Hue lighting app. There are third party applications as well you can buy. So turning to the back, there's just some key information down at the bottom that I want to talk about. First of all is Alexa, it can be used with Alexa or Google Assistant. It also works with Siri and HomeKit as well. Coming across, it's just got, it has 520 lumens, an LED bulb, it's up to 20,000 hours slash 20 years of actual usage, which is really quite amazing. It's instant on and instant going, and it can actually take 50,000 switches if you use the switch to turn it on or off. So that's really quite interesting to see here. And the rest of the packaging on the back is just going through retail information and obviously the setup process and what you require. So at the bottom here, there's just a bit of tape that I'm just gonna cut. Just cut that. Flip it around. So once flipped around, inside here, it gives you a bit of detail about how long it will last on the battery. There's multiple different ones here for the different modes it has. So obviously you can change this via the app, but with the button that is on this light, you can press and you'll get one of these options and it will cycle through for you. So really interesting to see 24 hours of use with and then all the way down to three hours of use, some are two and a half hours, just depending on its brightness and its level of color. But really nice option to see there about the battery life. So just lift this up. Sat inside is our light, so our Philips Hue Go portable light. So it's got a bit of cover, just take this off. As you might have known, for the ones that are really focused on the background, you might see one already set up over there. I did actually have a quick look at it. So a very nice light here that you can either have in this position or with a pedestal here, you can stand up, which is really great. Coming around here, we've got our power connection and then underneath you've got your light that you can just press here. So you've got a button and it might have some battery in it. Does it have any in it? No, it doesn't, but I'll show you how that works anyway. But it can sit on a desk like that, which is really nice, or as you can see over there in that corner, you can actually see it stands up. I'm wondering who actually noticed it before I mentioned. Leave a comment down below if you did. So underneath we have some instructions and some manuals the information to go through. Again, if you do have any questions or queries though, drop a comment down below. I'm actually more than happy to help. So that folds right out. And we've got warranty and safety information as well. Inside this little packaging here, 
you're going to find your UK three pin plug. So I'm going to grab that out and we're going to plug it in and then we're going to go through the app process together. So welcome back. So I've pulled up the application here in the iOS app store. Like I said, it is in the Google Play store. So just type in Philips Hue and then it shows you what you can do here and make sure you download this. So I'm just going to tap open on here and that shows me my lights that I currently have at the moment that you see along the background. And like I said, if you was clever enough, you did notice that lights I'm already using. So actually let's add this one in as well. So it will need to be charged up first of all. So like I said, we're just gonna put this in here. There we go. So we're greeted with our light. And like I said, with this button underneath, you can actually press this and you can see it changes and these will correspond to them different battery levels that it mentioned. I like this one, this is like a candle, it looks really nice actually. It sort of moves around the light, it sort of flickers, quite like that one. Again, you've got different options here. This is what I like with the Hue lighting system is that you can use this then to focus light and it looks so nice on a white wall in the background. I like this one as well, the mauve or violet color looks really nice. And then again, it'll cycle through and you can press and hold to power off and it'll power off for us. But actually what we need to do is now add this in the application. So I'm gonna do this on the iOS version. Sorry, it's not on the Google Play version, but on the iOS version, you're gonna come over to settings and then you're gonna to go to light setup. And what we want to do is search for a light. So we're gonna add light and then it'll begin to search. So we're gonna say search, gonna power it back on. No, don't need to, which is great. So it's come up here, go light one. So we're gonna tap on here. You saw it flash up. You can rename this as well. So I'm gonna rename this for the left side of the desk. So now I know that's where that is. That's fine, that's in my list here and I can designate a room now. So if I go down to rooms and scenes and go down to office, and then I can tick the ones that I want all in this room. So I'm gonna tick this one. So this is in my living room currently, this one. And we're gonna hit done, which is great. So now that's done, we're gonna come over to this side and as you can see here, I've got four lights now instead of three. So turn on, there we go. And then I can adjust this. So you can have a real soft light just depending however you want it. And of course you can go all the way up as well. And I can ask Siri to turn off all of my lights. Turn off all office lights. Okay, the lights are off. So there we go, they go all off. Turn all office lights on. Okay, the lights are on. It remembers where I set. Obviously you can set presets as well in different scenes, which is really nice. So I worked with Honor previously, so we have an Honor color, and that looks really nice as well. It sort of sets them to these colors. Going back to the light as well, you'll see which ones are sort of set and the way they're set. And you can jump in here and actually change these depending however you want to. I'm not gonna mess around with this scene. Otherwise, there are preset scenes here, so you can have sort of ocean feel, or like the Aurora sky, I believe this one is. You can have Safari. You can just have all different sort of ones that... So there's loads of different options inside here and you can change and adjust them. You've got your palette wheel as well and you can change and adjust. You can take a photograph and you can pick the color out of your photograph. With over 16 million colors to choose from, it's actually endless and the options are actually amazing. So tap into office again, go back to the list here. And as you can see, I can actually change and adjust all of the brightness up here at the top if I want to, to make them all, and you can see they all slide along. So actually so much you can do in this application. But that was a look at the Philips Hue Go portable lighting here. And obviously, like I said, you can use this button as well. You can also lose the cable as well. You don't need the cable. So it might be a bit of charge in there now. Yeah, there's a bit of charge in there now, which is great. I'm just going to set the cable to the side here. So now, actually, I can take this wherever I want to go with me. If I want to go outside and meditate, if I want to go outside during a barbecue, just make sure you charge it up. And like I said, there's two different ways of actually shining this light. So it can be done like this, which you're seeing over in that corner, whoever was actually watching the video in the background. Or you can have it like this, a center focal point. And this is where it makes the ambience really nice and really enjoyable. So you could be on a date night, you could be having a meal, you could be having a game night, you could just 
be doing anything. I'm gonna be creating more videos around the Philips Hue light system and actually what you can do with it because it's so interesting and so variant as well. In the description, I will leave a link to Philips Hue system and the best place to go and buy them and also a link to these ones. But let me know what you think. It's always great to hear from you. Thanks always for watching. If you haven't yet already, please make sure you hit subscribe to stay updated with all of my latest videos. And for me, Ricky, I'll see you really soon. Bye for now.